Today I'm going to tell you why you should save up some money. The gist of it is, you never know what life is going to throw at you. You might want to buy those brand new $150 Jordans, but then next week the tranny on the car goes out. Do you have enough in the bank to cover that? If a kid gets sick, or you get sick, and insurance can't cover it, or you don't got insurance, can you at least afford yourself basic care? You know, everybody recommends that you should have at least six months of living expenses in your bank account to cover any emergencies. And it's a smart thing to do because in this world of excess and keeping up with the Joneses, nobody's saving money anymore, everybody's spending it. And then when something bad happens to you, who's going to give you money? You know, if you don't got credit or you got bad credit, the bank isn't going to give you money. Your friends all go away when you need money, at least the fake ones. You have some true loyal friends who got your back, but you can't always depend on that. Everybody else has their own problems in life. You have to prepare for the little things. What if you find out you're going to be a mom or dad? You got to buy yourself some baby supplies. Them diapers aren't cheap. Baby food isn't cheap. Rent ain't cheap anymore. Back in the day, I could get a 600 square foot apartment for like $400. Now you'd be lucky to find anything like six hundred, seven hundred dollars, and that's not including utilities. You can invest any excess, is what I recommend for you to do, because once you spend it, it's gone, and it is in somebody else's wallet. Make sure the money stays in your pocket, and nobody has their hands in your pocket. Think about yourself, your family, significant other, Eddie Arkin Black.